so children here we are going to study about the ticket railway ticket we've already studied in the last week last video so the train number the date to start start date of the start of the journey the birth number and the fare okay the cost of the ticket so i had told you you have to see the ticket very carefully look for the train number so this is the train number and the number of the train is 9037 okay now the date of the start of the journey so on which day the day the train the journey will start so journey is starting on 24 12 2006 okay what is the date 24 12 2006 so here you can write 24 12 you can write the answer in front of it 24 12 2006 okay now the next question is the birth number so these are the birth number a121 okay uh, this is the birth number you have to write only this a1 21 22 and 23 okay lower birth side and the upper birth so these are the birth number 21 22 and 23 are the birth number okay next question is the fare or the cost of the ticket so you can see here the cost of the ticket is written the cost of the ticket is 2578 only means 2578 rupees okay so this is the this is how we uh, look for the you know the um, the information given on the ticket so the ticket railway ticket has different information given it is pnr number ticket train number date on which it will start the kilometer you have to travel how many male and how many children are studying i mean <laughs> children are boarding and going for the journey and the, the birth number you can see the coach number you can see the male and female you can see ages you can see even you can see the the total cost of the fare the ticket the total cost of the ticket okay so the you can also see the name of the train Avad Express. Okay, so here we studied about the um, the information given on the ticket. Let's move ahead. Write about the inform. Write uh, what the information you can find out from the ticket. A railway timetable has gives given the details about the routes of every now this you have to underline children first we studied about the railway ticket now we'll see the railway timetable so a railway timetable gives the detail about the routes of the every train station along the route and what time train will reach and leave each station okay the distance covered etc we can also buy a railway timetable from the railway station some parts of the timetable so some portion of the timetable for the routes of the train on which omana traveled are given look carefully at it and answer the following question so children this is the timetable you know the the different time and the different station omana traveled through so umana started from ahmedabad station okay 
Arrival time is 11.30. Departure time is 11.50. And 301 km from, its, from the place where it started. So it started from the place called Gandhi Dham. That is why the distance is written 0. Because it traveled started from Gandhi Dham. Then from Gandhi Dham, it took 301 kilometer, right? It took 301 kilometer from Gandhi Dham to reach to Ahmedabad. And from Ahmedabad to Vadodara, it took another 401 kilometer. Surat from Vadodara to Surat, it is 503, 530, then Valsar 598. Okay, so distance traveled. It started from here, then it traveled 301, then 401, then 530, 598, 772. Like this, Nagar Coil is the place where they go down. Actually, they go down at Kottayam. But the last station where this train will go is Nagara Coil. Okay. So, the distance traveled by the Omana from Ahmedabad. Okay. To Kottayam. So, will be actually 2418 minus 301. Because this distance they do not, they didn't travel, isn't it? They started from this place means the train has already traveled from there to there. So this min has to be minus. So you have to minus this and you will get this 2117. So this is the distance traveled by the Umana throughout her journey so 2117 kilometer so it started at Ahmedabad and finished at Kottayam okay so now they are asking you some questions which we have to answer circle the names of all the station in the table that are mentioned in Umana's diary so I, they have started from Ahmedabad and Ahmedabad, the Vadodara, Surat, Valsar, Bivandi Road, Madgaon, Udipi, Kozikor, Trichur, then Erna, Kulam Town and Kottayam. So they are asking only circle the names of the stations which are mentioned in Umana's diary. So that you have to find Ahmedabad is there. Vadodara, then we see Valsar, then we see Madgao, Udipi, Kojikor, yeah, Kottayam. These are the different, different stations Umana mentioned in the diary. From which station the train start? Train started from Gandhi Dham. How many minutes did train stop at Ahmedabad station? Ahmedabad station, it stopped. It arrived at 11.30 and moved by departure by 11.50. So what is the, um, the difference? It is 20 minutes. So 20 minutes it, it the train stopped at Ahmedabad station. On which day the journey of the train reached, on which day of the journey the train reached to Madgao that you have to study or just see. It is they have started from where and which day they start, they stopped. Then Sunil and Anne got off Kojikod station, Umana got off at Kottayam station. How many hours does the train take to reach to Kottayam from Kojikod? You can see the Kojikod, the time is 17.50, it re sorry, it reached at 17.45. Okay, and then it got time, it reached at 23.50. 23.50. So, you have to minus this from there. So, you 5.45, 17.45 is 5.45 or you can see 
17 then you can just count 18 19 20 21 22 23 6 hours and either 45 and here 50 so 5 minutes 6 hours 5 minutes it took to reach from Khozikor to Kottayam okay so like this children you have to answer all these questions okay would you like to keep a diary take a note or diary every day for a week write about what you did also write your thoughts and feelings share your diaries with your friends so children here you should also share the diaries you should also start writing in the diaries and share it with the friends whatever you did or you learned something new okay since we are at home so you can make a role make a diary and start writing about it what you learned in that like what you learned today the whole day anything you learned very good any movie you watched any documentary movie you watched which you want to share with others and they should know about it so you should mention it in the diary so i would request all of you children to start writing the diary okay so here we are done with the chapter children so i'll be sending you some question and answers of this chapter which you have to write it in your notebook